And welcome back to racing today where the spirit of South African horse racing is alive and well. Now you know how we love to arm ourselves with knowledge and information on these streets. And today we managed to uh, meet up with the hub of equine excellence. Let's see what they have to share with us. Now, of course, I am at the Bolu Equestrian Academy, and naturally, I have to speak to a lecturer before I get onto the grounds and speak to any of the students. Please break down what it is that you do here and what the typical syllabus kind of is. So we offer a post matric course, um, students after school, any, any student wanting to go into the equine industry in any field, essentially. We give them a basic of horsemanship, horse mastership, stable yard skills. Um, they can essentially qualify through us as a stable manager, an instructor, they can broaden out into any aspect of the industry from us. So essentially, if you've passed the Aquasa exams, you have an international qualification. So it is recognized in 53 countries in the world. Um, you can go anywhere. Kerry, let's talk about the, the facilities that you have here. Um, what is the, the campus, what does it comprise of? We're very blessed here. We do have a, a state-of-the-art facility. Um, we do have the lecture room, obviously. <laughs> we have to have somewhere to give classes. We have our beautiful barn here. We have four horses of our own that are on campus all the time. Um, the barn consists of our four stables, we have a feed room, we have two tack rooms, luckily we have one for all of our working equipment and one for our learning equipment. And we have been very blessed this year, we've opened a new arena, Sand Arena, right. it's been an absolute wonder, we've got jumping equipment in there, we are able to build a dressage arena for any of our students who want to ride a dressage test. So, Carly, I understand you've been a student here as well, but uh, your journey is quite different. You came all the way from Zimbabwe and there were some challenges as well. Well, so I was born and raised in Zimbabwe, lived there all my life, um, and I have previously done a degree, an art degree. Um, however, my journey with horses, it came back. It came back to life and I wanted to study and I wanted to learn again and doing research I came across the Academy and it was a perfect eight month course and I thought this has everything I need to learn. Being at the Academy they have taken us through absolutely everything from the very beginning which has allowed me to grow in my work and grow with the horses. Of course, we've got a prospective student here at the Bolu Equestrian Academy starting next year. Mohali, are you ready for this journey? Definitely. I've been ready, you know. Horses have been my thing and I just can't wait to embark on this journey and see how far it's going to be. You say horses are your thing. Elaborate on that. What's your history with horses um, coming from Soweto? Well, I started riding, of course, in 2010. I started riding at the Soweto Equestrian Centre with Ntate Mafogate. And he's the one who taught me the love for horses. He's the one who made me realise uh, my passion for horses. And ever since then, I don't see myself anywhere else. Right, Yvonne, thank you so much for having us and thank you so much for joining us on, on Racing Today. As far as your love for education, where does that come from? I was a, a riding coach, a, a show jumping coach, and that is also teaching and, and passing on your knowledge. Um, and then this position came up and we basically weren't sure that they'd actually take me on because of my age. But they did because of my experience. So it's put me in a position where I just love. I love the administrative side of it. I love organizing everything for the students and for Kerry to do the lecturing. No, I just, I, I love that part of it. I really do. So Yvonne, with this particular academy as an institution of, of learning, it is quite different from, from any other institution. What's, what's different about this place? I think the major difference is that it's a skills training academy. So we are doing a lot of practical work. Um, so that would be very different to somewhere like a university where it's more academic. Here we are training our, our students to, to go, almost become technicians in riding, if you like. So they can go out and into any of the equine careers um, that are available. Well, Yvonne, we really appreciate, firstly, the work that you're doing. Uh, it is much needed, and, it, and clearly the benefits are far-reaching.